Hey guys, it's Katie and welcome back to my YouTube channel. This week's video I am super excited for because I'm going to be sharing with you some cleaning hacks. So as you all know, it is officially summer now. Open your door and go outside. You should be able to tell. Since it's summer now, everyone's lives, I'm sure, are getting so busy. At least mine are. Hopefully I'm not the only one. Anyways, um, summer is a very, very busy season, you know, yeah. Since everyone's so busy, we forget about having time to clean, and we don't have time to clean. So I'm going to be sharing with you some cleaning hacks that you can still keep a room clean without, like, spending tons of time doing it, if that makes sense. So, get excited! So basically this video is titled, How to Keep a Clean Room All the Time. But if you are new here to my channel, feel free to go down below and click that subscribe button so you don't miss when I upload next here on my channel. And without further ado, I think it is about time to clean, so let me share with you some of my favorite tips and let's get into it. Let's go. Summer gets to be very tiring, doesn't it? So, give some time to yourself and take a little nap. But sometimes you don't want to take a nap on your bed because then you have to take all your pillows off, if you're like me. Then you feel bad on taking your pillows off because then you gotta put them back on later. So, I got an idea, okay? You can still take a nap on your bed without taking your pillows off. So, whenever you go to take a nap, get a random blanket, this is just mine that I had at the bottom of my bed, lay on your bed and cover up with your blanket. So you still are under a blanket, but not under the blankets that your pillows are sitting on, if that makes sense. So instead of pulling back your blankets and then having to remove all your pillows, you just lay on your bed, grab a random throw blanket, and there you go, you can still take a nap on your comfy bed, without taking off your pillows and then having to re-put them on. And you're good! So, I think this is a great hack that you guys should try, so yeah! So this next tip that I have for you is for you to have what you would call a dump bin. You may have seen this in one of my previous videos, but if you don't know what this is, a dump bin is basically where you set it anywhere in your room, any just bin, basket, whatever, container, anywhere in your room, and then whenever you have something random or just something you don't have time to put in its spot at the moment, you just throw it all into this bin instead of throwing it onto your bed, on your floor, on your desk, etc. Just throwing it into this bin and it's all in the bin instead of everywhere else. And then when you have some free time later, then you go through that bin and put all the stuff that's in your dump bin into its actual spot. So I would say set your dump bin somewhere around your door. So right when you walk in, you can just throw whatever you have right there in your bin so it's easiest for you. I think this is a great tip to really save you some time at the moment, but also keep your room clean. So I think this one's really great. You guys definitely need to try this one if you haven't already. So that is tip number two. This third tip that I have for you guys today is to keep a trash can somewhere in your room. Now I feel like this should be more self-explanatory, but some people may just overlook this. So I personally have a trash can right down here beside my desk. I think it's a great place for it. And then whenever I have any junk or trash or stuff I don't want anymore in my room, I just throw it all into there and there you go. Yeah. <laughs> Next one for you is to have wall hooks. Wall hooks anywhere on your wall would be great. As you can see right here, I have my wall hook on the wall holding some of my accessories here. But wall hooks are great for if you have any hats, purses, accessories all on the floor or anywhere in your room that they shouldn't be. Wall hooks will eliminate your things from being on the floor and getting in your way. You can simply just take a hat that was on the floor, hang it up, it actually even looks cute, it looks like you know what you're doing, and 
and it looks like you're organized and honestly it works as a great decor piece too you guys need to try this one Next and last cleaning hack that I have for you guys is to simply just have a clothes hamper. So this one is very simple that almost anyone can do. Even some of you may already have a clothes hamper, which that's great because that's what you need to do. Have a clothes hamper because all of your clothes that have been laying all over the floor can all go into the clothes hamper. But you get what I'm saying? Point being, have a clothes hamper, throw all of your clothes that are on the floor, on your bed, on your desk, into um, your clothes hamper. It's as simple as that. Get yourself a clothes hamper and your room should be clean. And just like that, this cleaning video is already over. Hopefully you guys learned some tips and tricks on how to keep your room clean. Um, let me know if you guys actually use these and if they help you. Also, let me know down below if you want to see more cleaning videos or organizing videos, and I'll try and make those happen. But if you guys did enjoy this week's video, be sure to give it a big thumbs up by clicking that like button so I know you guys enjoyed it. And hopefully you guys are enjoying your summer. You know, we're already in July. That just still blows me away. But anyways, guys, I think that is pretty much it for this week's video, and I love you all so much, and I'll see you all in my next video. Bye-bye.